what's happening here is there are people who have cultural, political, religious, economic philosophies that they then invoke when they want to cherry pick one scientific result or another. You can find a scientific paper that says practically anything. And the press, which I count you as part of, the press will sometimes find a single paper. So here's a new truth. If this study holds it, but an emergent scientific truth, for it to become an objective truth, a truth that is true whether or not you believe in it, it requires more than one scientific paper. It requires a whole system of people's research, all leaning in the same direction, all pointing to the same consequences. That's what we have with climate change as induced by human conduct. This is a known correspondence. If you want to find the 3% of the papers or the 1% of the papers that conflicted with this and build policy on that, that is simply irresponsible. And what, how else do you establish a scientific truth if not by looking at the consensus of scientific experiments and scientific observation?